it's been 333 days since we've had high school basketball. Since then, we've had a world pandemic. We've had two lockdowns. We've had continuous cancellations and postponements of sports. But tonight, we're finally back. We got about 200 fans in attendance here at Lake Orion Fieldhouse for tonight's varsity basketball game between Lake Orion Dragons and the University Ferndale Eagles. Hi, everyone. I'm Derek Seal, alongside my partner, Jake Parsons. 16 seconds left. Looks like the Dragons will hold for the last shot of the quarter. Nine seconds left. If I'm Dragons, I'm Fisher. The rip. Five seconds left. Fisher. Over there, McClear. McClear. Fits it up before the buzzer. He nails it! Before the buzzer, Will McClear! That fits the Dragons up by 12. Knieper with the serve. Sends it over. Handled by Seaholm. Sends it over. Oh, what a save! Number three! Jenna McCauley, as that is Point Lake Orion, but what a save by McCauley. Marshall will take it up, stolen by Ritt, keeps it in bounds. As McClear is able to, Dragons keep it in, find Bryant, sorry, and one! Brennan Jones! Over to Sanders, nice ball movement by the Eagles here. Sanders. Knocks down McClear, gets him moving as he makes a jumper. We're all tied up here at 12. Nice move by Sanders there. Ritt, 4 3. Cutching! Oh, and Ritt, 4 3. Oh, what a play by McCauley there! Keeps the Lakers' defense asleep. What a running save. They hit it back over. That looks like Nina Horning on the save. Nice save by McCauley. Horning, where no one is, and point Dragons. You know, we talk about boxing out. That goes for the Stony Creek. They had, Lake Orion had two or three opportunities. They weren't able to cash in on any of them. You know, looking at the Dragons, you know you're going to be double teamed right now. Don't pass it into the corner. When you pass it into the corner, that's like getting quadruple teamed. There's no way you can get the ball out when you pass it into the corner. So just finding your open passer there, or finding your open teammate and not passing it into the corner. Here we go, 8.5 seconds left. Liddell over to Fisher. Fisher's going to take it up. Can he get a shot off? Finds McClear. McClear. Fisher. He got it off before the buzzer. He misses it off the right iron. As you know, we talk about the Lady Dragons. We've talked about them. It's the turnovers. I think it's really the turnovers in the second and third quarter that killed them tonight. They had too many mistakes. This is going to be a game that they look back on if they make a run and I think this is going to be a turning point in their season. They fall to 2 to 4. They play Waterford Kettering at home next week. This, I think this is going to be a turning point for them. There's a lot of hard lessons learned tonight, but tough loss overall. 